Etrachan saw it. See ya! Bye! I'm Karin. I live with my husband and my son. Okay, Kuroki, let's get you dressed up. You're gonna be late for school. Okay. Bye, Mom. Bye. Hey, did you guys hear about the Berkeley on 3rd? What? Again? That's so scary. It's been happening a lot recently. We gotta be careful. We already got robbed once, so... Wait, you were robbed? Yeah, well, not our house, but... Someone stole money from my husband's wallet. What? What happened? Everything okay? It wasn't much, and we caught the person who did it, so it's fine, but... What happened? Well, it was five years ago. My husband got sick, and he went into surgery. It took him a while to recover. Sorry about this, Karin. Stop apologizing. Eat up. You'll feel better soon, okay? You probably can't walk yet, but if you get hungry, use this, okay? I'll leave it in the shelf here. Yeah, thanks. Then... Mr. Tokusa, we're gonna turn the lights off soon. Oh, okay. I'm thirsty. Ugh. Crap. I forgot to ask Karin. What's the matter? Oh, um, nothing. I just wanted some water, but I forgot to buy one. Oh, want me to go buy one for you? You sure? Of course. Here you go. Thank you so much. I'll put this back in the shelf, okay? Thanks. The next day. Morning, Takusa. How are you feeling? Much better. Good to hear. Hey, um, could you go to the store and get me a newspaper? Sure, hold on. Here you go. That'll be $1.20. Thanks. Huh? There's only like $14 in here. He must have bought something yesterday. Here you go. Thanks. Hey, did you buy something yesterday? Yeah. I bought a bottle of water right before bed. How? The nurse bought it for me. Oh. What else? Huh? That's it. Just water. Huh? Huh? So, yeah. Wow. Water is a dollar at most, so it doesn't add up. You mean... Yeah, something fell off. So I took the change and put another $20 in the wallet. Then... Mr. Tokusa, can I get you anything from the vending machines today? Oh, uh... Maybe some chocolate? Chocolate? Okay, I'll swing by the store. Oh, thanks. Sure. Sorry to keep you waiting. Thank you. Huh. Huh? When he checked the wallet, it was about $5 short. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Then my husband called. Karin, it was $5 short. I see. I better talk to her in person. The next day. Mr. Tokusa, need anything? Can I get some candy? Sure thing. Hey! That's our money! What are you doing? Yeah. So I caught her red-handed. Then I called her manager and told her what happened. So the chocolate she bought yesterday, it was only $2. So where did the rest of it go, huh? The same thing happened when you bought that water for him. Akane, is this true? Ugh. I'm sorry! I'm sorry! I knew it was wrong, but I couldn't help it! You see, I just got a divorce, and I have a son. I just really needed the money. I took the five dollars for lunch! I'm really sorry! Yeah! Ugh. So yeah. She paid me back the fifteen dollars on the spot. Oh, wow! But she did it three times, right? Yeah, she was probably doing it to others, too. What happened to her? Not sure, but... Her boss looked pissed. I heard she got fired after that. What? Huh? huh? Poor woman! She got fired over fifteen dollars? Huh? huh? Why did you have to tell her boss? You could have just told her in person. But stealing is wrong. Yeah, how much she stole is irrelevant. Yeah, otherwise she'll never learn. Oh, you guys are so uptight. But... And she's a single mom, right? If it was me, I would have let her go. Maybe you're a bit too harsh on her. Uh, what? But I'm the victim here! What's wrong with her? Uh... Hope she got a new job. Hope her kid is okay. Then... 
I told my husband about it. Wow, she's unbelievable. I know, right? I was really upset that she insulted me. And so what if she's a single mom? That's got nothing to do with this. True. Wait, maybe she experienced something similar herself. Huh? You mean she's a thief too? Yeah. <laughs> no way! She wouldn't do that. You never know. But then... A few weeks later... Oh, what's going on? Karin! Yuri, Susuji. What's going on? Not sure. Stop! That hurts! Ouch! Quiet! What? what? Yup, my husband was right. Isn't that Azami? Yeah, turns out she was the one stealing stuff. Oh. Turns out she was the one that was stealing stuff from everyone in the neighborhood. So that means she wasn't trying to protect that nurse. She said all that because she was a thief herself. Yeah, she's unbelievable. After that, Azami got arrested. Her husband left her and took her son with him. I feel so bad for the kid, but I guess this is for the best. Yeah, she probably doesn't even feel bad about what she did. At least the nurse felt remorse. What goes around comes around. No bad deed goes unpunished. Hopefully, those two women learn their lesson.小学であろうと高学であろうともどちらも盗みという犯罪行為に変わりありません。被害者がいて迷惑をかけている時点で悪いことなのですから、どんな理由があっても盗みは正当化することはできません。ましてそれを擁護しようなんてちょっといやなか